So we're going to do this 10th one of that practice exam. And uh, I have the square root. So I'm going to square both sides to get rid of that square root. And notice I have uh, that. But if I square v minus 3, remember, squaring means times itself. So that's v minus 3 times v minus 3. So if I multiply that out, that's going to be v squared minus 6v plus 9. Great. So I have a quadratic. Get it equal to 0. Subtract 2v from both sides. Add 7 to both sides. So 0 would be v squared minus 8v plus 16. Okay. Uh, things that multiply to 16 add to negative 8 are negative 4 and negative 4. So v equals 4. I don't need to write it twice. Uh, it equals 4. So let me plug it in, see if it works. So it does 2 times, the square root of 2 times 4 minus 7. Does that equal 4 minus 3? Let's see, 4 minus 3 is 1. This is 8 minus 7. That's square root of 1, not negative 1. That's square root of 1. So yeah, that checks out. V is 4.